Get up, get out, get around, and do it, do it! <laughs> What's going on, guys? How you doing today? I'm doing well. Ooh, thank you for asking. Just got back from the chiropractor and from the store. My back's feeling quite a bit better. I'm still probably around 60% of myself, of my normal craptastic self, but we're getting there, guys. Today, what we're going to do on the Everyday Kitchen, we're going to make some breakfast burritos. They're going to be extremely simple. I'm really honestly only doing this to do one thing and one thing only. To try out my new hot sauce. You're probably not going to be able to see this. It's called Marie Sharps. Proud products of Belez or whatever. Beware. Comatose heat level. Habanero pepper sauce. So yeah, it's got, it's at least got habanero. I can't read the thing because it's the same color as it's red and it's got small black letters on it and I can't read it but hey there she is how you doing everybody try my new hot sauce anyway I'm gonna try this hot sauce on some very simple breakfast burritos so let's start on the breakfast burrito making shall we we're gonna cut up one itty bitty onion I'm not gonna use the whole onion of course that would be crazy I am not a professional when it comes to knives We're going to put some ham.
I did warm these up a little bit. Now, I'm gonna just use some of this on this one burrito for now and see how it goes. Since it's new, never tasted it, we're gonna see how it goes. All right, guys, gonna give her a taste test. Beware, comatose heat level. Well, you've seen how much I put on there. Let's see if it's comatose heat level. You can taste the heat. There is some heat. Mm. Yeah, there's a little heat. Mm -mm. There's a good taste to it too. So it's not, it's not all just about heat with me. I like a good taste. Just to make, just to get a good taste of how it does taste. A spoonful. It has a familiar flavor with a lot of the other hot sauces that I normally eat. Texas Pete, Louisiana, stuff like that. But there's more heat than those two. Yeah. That's pretty good. I'm going to say though, I don't know if it's even on the level of uh, sriracha, the, the normal sriracha sauce. I don't know if it's even quite quite like that, quite as bad. To me, sriracha sauce is pretty warm. Mmm. Good little burrito. You seen how easy it was. And that's only meat I had. I don't have any like little I don't have little chunks of ham. I don't have different kinds of ham. I don't have any sausage or anything like that. So I just use some black forest sandwich meat. Yeah, there's a good bit of heat. I like that. It's not overpowering. 
Not for me. Now, say, say my wife were to try this, she'd have cardiac arrest. She'd be gone. If you're looking for something with still a good taste, but it takes up the heat just a little, another notch or two, pretty good. Marie Sharps. Even the sodium's not horrible. 45 milligrams for, I guess, a teaspoon, TSP. Yeah, that's not bad as far as I'm concerned. There you go. Good stuff. Well, I got two more of those I'm going to eat. But I'll do that off camera. I don't want y'all to get too jealous. So there you have it, guys. We had a taste test. Good stuff. Try it. And we had a quick, simple, little breakfast burrito how-to when you're in the mood for a little burrito. All good stuff, man. All right. Hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you enjoy the channel. Like, share, subscribe, comment. All that good stuff. Don't forget, guys, get up, get out, get ready, do it to it, even when sweating just a tad. From the Habanero! We'll see y'all later. Get up, get out, get ran, and do it, do it!